Hi guys, it's Cindy from Cindy's Art. Today we're going to do a very small two and a half by three and a half inch painting and they make great trading cards if you like to uh, trade uh, little art cards with other artists. They're something you can exchange and give away for free or give them to your friends. So we're going to start off with uh, my Arches watercolor paper. I highly recommend good quality paper and I'll find some suggestions for you for other types of paints that are a little bit more affordable. I use Holbein, love them. So I'm just gonna start off with what I wet on this painting and add some colors in for the sky, let that blend through. We're not going for a lot of layers today. This is an excellent warm-up size, or if you are wanting to learn how to paint, uh, do some small paintings that are simple like this, takes you a few minutes, let you practice, let you learn and uh, see where it takes you. Practice makes perfect. The colors that I'm using for this painting are ultramarine blue deep, uh, a mineral green, hooker's green, aurelian yellow, a little bit of yellow ochre in a few minutes, and that's a tiny bit of crimson for that pink tone. I'm using very, very simple colors. And I do use some neutral in this uh, painting. The neutral is more of that darker black or a brownish black that I'm gonna use for the tree line. Let your paper dry before you start on these trees so that way you don't wind up with blurry bushes. You want really nice details. And the fog that's in this picture, all I did was paint my, um, my tree branches and then I took a wet brush and I softened up some of uh, the upper branches and that gave that misty type of look to it.
as I'm wrapping up, hit subscribe if you would like to keep in touch. I would love to see your paintings and I share how to do that down below in my description. And I've really enjoyed having you here today. I am going to do a few more trading card examples that you can do. And again, you can give these away as little bookmark uh, cards for people too for Christmas. So start your Christmas projects early. I'll have a number of ideas for you uh, this fall. Thanks guys, have a good one.